baby. Yo, what's up, everybody? Time for yet another break. 2018 Heritage Baseball number three. Let's do it to it. All right, let's put this up on the screen. Come on. Forgot to do my little formatting deal there. Let's put this on the screen. With the exception of one team that I put in a filler, we filled this thing straight through the store. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Put that on the screen for you. Very nice. Put that aside. All right, let me go grab the case. Number four, already down to 15 teams. So we should be able to fill number four tonight as well. I'm down for this marathon, y'all. Case Mojo. Full caser, baby. teams that were taken in four Astros and Phillies in number four it shows 15 teams left let's see the Mets are gone Nationals as well. Got it. So, I mean, technically, I could start working on the filler for that number four right now. What the heck is this? Is it a poster? Let's check this out. Put this at a different angle. Sure looks like a poster. First time seeing this in this year's uh, heritage. Well, that's pretty cool. Number 21 of 30 for the Rangers, Adrian Beltre. A little uh, a little poster. There you go, Rangers fan. Whoever got the Rangers, that's uh, going your way. Put that aside. That poster would have been super sweet if it was autographed. Yeah, limited to 30 apparently. What's up, Keyshawn? How are you? I kind of want to start working on a filler for Heritage number four. While we work on this one. Eric, my dude. So check it. This is the filler. Thirty-five dollars. No, thirty-four. Let's do thirty-four. Thirty-four dollars a spot. Fourteen spots total. 
everyone gets a random team plus the Yankees random to the filler. You're probably right, Joe Pop. But you know, I like to be ahead of the game, man. I want to start working on the next one while I do this, because this break is going to take. I, I think uh, we we have gotten me down to a solid hour twenty minutes on this. Eric, instead of putting Rip City filler number four. Uh, could you put Heritage Filler number four? Or Heritage number four filler? Some people might get, you know, confused. So $34, uh, you're going to get a random team plus a shot at the Yankees. So you could get two teams... For 34 bucks, essentially, in this filler. It's a full case of Heritage Baseball. Heritage number four. If you want to buy your team, you can definitely do so. Just check out our website. And off rip is the purple hot box, which is a one per case. So, nice way to start here with some colors. The purple, uh, purple cards, they're just purple refractors. They're not numbered but they are pretty to look at especially if you put them in the light just right that's a base short print I will be uh, double checking this stuff at the end of the night, whenever that is. And my sorters will also do the same. So, no worries. If you see me pass something though, please let me know in the chat, and I'll uh, you know I'll go back and try to find it. Uh, but like I said, we do double, triple check all this stuff and make sure that we get all the variations and short prints out. But if you've been watching today, I'm pretty good at catching them. But that's why we also double, triple check it too. Joshua down for one, my dude. Mike Trout, Angels patch right there. Hit a Nolan Ryan auto earlier in Heritage number one, matter of fact. Action image right here for Mike Trout of the Angels. You can see it right there, right underneath the card number. I'm glad they made it easier to read because a couple of years ago, you had to, you literally had to look at the code. Now they kind of make it easier for us by putting it right under underneath the uh, the card number. Letting you know what kind of variation it is and so forth. How's everything with you, Eric, Joshua? Everyone else uh, here watching, how's everybody doing today? Tonight, I should say. It's approaching midnight over here on the east coast of things. Miami, Florida to be specific. I'm just getting started. I'm working on my third case of Heritage. I have five more in the store. And I'm supremely confident that we can fill uh, Heritage number four tonight. Sean Manea of the A's to 570.
One Soto Purple Refractor there. Two different teams on that. Wait, did Machado get paid more than Harper did on his deal? I do, Eric, I do. Uh, Breakers is up, and so is YouTube, of course. Why do you ask? Big chilling tonight, off work from tomorrow. Nice. Technically, so do I. I have uh, f my days off or Fridays and Saturdays. I'm going to try to see if Jason will, uh, will will give me Sunday off. He gave me Monday off, but low-key, he still owes me a day. He still owes me a day. Oh, okay. Gotcha, Eric. Gotcha. Harper was 330. How much is how much did Machado get? No, I don't, Joe Pa. Jason came up with it in the first place. Ah, Machado got three hundred. So what's so what's the difference? Like, how many years is Harper's deal compared to uh, Machado? Either way, that's a lot of freaking money to swing a bat at a ball. So who got 13? So wait, Harper got 13 years, 330 million, and Machado got 10 years, 300 million. Am, am I correct in this? On this? Dude, Machado got a better deal. Now, maybe my numbers are wrong. But 330 million, 13 years, that's that's what? 20 about 25 million dollars a year compared to 300 million at 10 years. That's a 5 million dollar difference a year. So, depends on how you want to look at it, but Machado kind of got a better deal. Oh, the guaranteed is better for Harper. Ah, oh, see, that was my next question. That was going to be my next question. Like, what's the guaranteed money looking like? Incentives and all that other good stuff. in this box number two let's put this over here better That sounds about right, Eric. Yeah, I, I would not be surprised. Uh, I'll revisit the filler uh, later on in this break to see where we're at. But thank you for letting me know, Eric. I figured people would buy teams uh, as we go along here, which is awesome news.
because I'm 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 ready to break all this heritage we have in the store tonight. Oh damn, Harper also got a no trade clause. Oh yeah, Harper got that deal. That that baller deal. That's a big short print. There is Hoskins nickname. We did hit the uh the Mondo earlier in in the last break for Harper. So the uh, the variations are starting to come out to play here. Padres still rebuilding, and Harper's going to a team ready to win now. Yeah, I'm actually going to start watch. I'm going to watch baseball this year. I haven't seen any spring training games cuz it's spring training. But I'm definitely going to be paying attention to the Marlins this year. I need to get my baseball knowledge up. The heck is this? It's got like a plasticky thing here on the end. What is that? I don't want to touch it because that's probably going to mess the card up. But that might be an error of some kind on uh, Top's behalf there. That's interesting. Syndergaard Mets relic there. Not sure what that uh, thing on the side there is about. I feel like if I pick at it, though, it'll ruin the card. So I'm not going to do that. A reverse negative, is that a real thing? Severino for the Yankees to nine nine nine. Oh, well, the name's not backwards, though. Just Noah Syndergaard. What I'm saying is, like, if you look at the end of the card here, you, know, you got some ridges on there. Like, it's like a film or something that's on there. Uh, I don't know. Let's keep it moving, moving. Got to put a stuff aside here. Because these base cards pile up. Close to 3,000 cards in a case of this. Yeah, buddy. Fourteen teams left to number four. Twenty-one and number five. Twenty-two and number six. I think we can get six breaks of this stuff filled tonight. We filled these first three pretty strong. Yeah, Joe Paul, they, they update it every day, I think. Like, even Tops doesn't know how many variations and stuff they came out with. So they, they do update it.
Where's my thing? You're right. I want to grow a stash like that. That's an action image. Bregman Astros. Matthew Wiener. Well, that's a pretty crappy story. But, uh, I hate to say it, but I'm going to say no. My, uh, my my troll alarm is going crazy right now. A anybody else's? O or is it just me? No, apparently Eric too. <laughs> Eric, I wasn't even done messing with the kid, man. Oh! An Altuve Astros on card. Auto. Very nice. There you go, Strolls. It's all good, Eric. I just like messing with trolls. That's, that's, that's one of the few things that bring me joy in life is messing with uh, with trolls as many of you know shit talking is like one of my favorite pastimes so shit talking a troll Pfft, is up there for me it's up there See, I already hit this nickname variation and the color swap, but that's still a base short print. Yankees rookie stars to 570 dude Joshua I haven't uploaded any of the heritage breaks yet sorry bro but you know I will get it done tonight I will get it done I just been feeling breaks like a madman box four Take another glance, see where number four is at. Number four stuck at 14 right now. Oh, uh, that's true, Eric. That's true. But you know what? Ain't nobody got time for that. So, 
I'm going to hide them. And I'm going to report them. So there you go. Matthew Wiener. <laughs> Matthew Wiener has been hitted by Rip City Cards. <laughs> Matt's Wiener is hidden. <laughs> uh, we need to grow up. All right. Dude, Eric, I take it far, man. I take it far. Greg, just so... Dude, I, see, this is why I wish we had kept them, you know, str stringing him along a little bit more for entertainment, uh, Eric. But whatever, what's done is done. So Greg, it, it was it was literally this. I think it's a child. It might be a grown man, or a woman, or in between, with nothing better to do. Basically, asking for free shit. Big day tomorrow. What you got tomorrow, Joe Pa? So I could so I could hit you with a, a quick Uncle Jesse blessing. You know I'll take care of you, Joe Pa. You know this. I got you. But what's uh, what you got going on tomorrow? Those divorce papers finally came through or something? What's, what's going on? I got you. Oh, snaps. Dude, I already know Jason's going to destroy Contender's Optic. So, Joe Paul, get a good nice sleep, my man. Appreciate everything you do, brother. I'll see you month. I'll see you Sunday, maybe? No. It is tax season. This is true. I have yet to file taxes. I have yet to file taxes. I wonder how much I'm going to owe this year. Hopefully none. But I know I will. Here, that's a big sharp print. Let's get it hot in here. So I gotta turn down the thermostat. Ah, oh, come on. See now, Joe Pod. See now. Now, now you're making me feel bad. So that's still not enough to make me want to call play play hooky though. <laughs> Jason owes me one, damn it. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Can't blame me for wanting a little three-day weekend. I don't get to see a little shininess here. Chris Bryant of the Cubs, two five seventy. Anthony Rizzo, Cubs patch.
right, three down. I'm sorry, four down. Eight left. You see a crazy auto. Indians are gone. So what would a filler look like in number four? Hmm. That's not bad. $34 a spot. 13 spots total. Everyone gets a random team in Heritage number four. Plus a chance at the Yankees as well. It's not a bad filler. Yankees still available. Big money team there. My man Eric. The wind beneath my wings. One more thing. I am curious. Mm. Got 10 people watching right now. So it's going to be a little tough. But it can be done. Yeah, still early. It's only midnight. Only midnight. Hopefully the West Coast people start pouring in and help us knock out the uh, the heritage number four here. We got. We gotta get our West Coast people in here, Eric. The yellow submarine. That's a big short print. Mike Michaelis, Cardinals, 
Eric, how was your day? Hope all was well with you. Did you have to slap anybody today? The action image for the Astros El Tuve. Astros having a pretty good break in this. Shout out to Scotty K. So far crushing this. What, who towels? What is that? Who towels? Cardinals Relic for Yadi Molina. Haven't had to slap anybody around in a bit. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Nah, that's probably for the best. It's probably for the best. Nowadays, you know, some they'll probably press charges on you. Oh, ha, ha. I get it now. After you explained it. Dude, you ever seen an owl in, like, real life? Them motherfuckers are creepy. Especially the way they be turning their necks and shit. Check on uh, characters number four. Hey, it's at 14. Going strong at 14. We still got 11 people watching. All right, so I can still keep the 10 of you entertained. I think I could knock out that four, number four tonight. I'm kind of just focused on this right now, though. I 
I mean, you are, though, aren't you, Eric? Or are you talking about the Facebook group? On the Facebook. Well, shit. Thirty-six weeks ago, when you first joined, look at you, you little cutie pie. Dude, I don't even know how to do this. Snap, Eric. You about to get bumped up. What the heck? It's not letting me add you. Why is that? Maybe you have to like. Hmm. Interesting. It's not. It's not letting me do it, uh, Eric. I know, right, Greg? Heritage would do that to you. Anyways, it's not letting me do it, Eric. It, it may be something on your end. I saw that you're managing another uh, break operation there. Maybe it only allows you to do one at, you know, one at, I don't know. A Renato action for the Rockies. You know, luckily, Greg, sanity is like, you know, that that's on the, the back burner. Don't really need that. As long as I can open packs of cards and go through them and show them all off and get excited when I hit something, you know, I'll be all right. My boy Tigers Black. Maybe that's why it's not letting me put you as a moderator. That's kind of weird. Facebook and their rules. Shit, I remember back when Facebook was only for college kids. And look at it now. That's weird, Eric. I need to look into that. I could definitely use another... Uh... What's the word I'm looking for? I don't want to say helper. But something like that. What do you mean? Oh, you started Facebook when you were in college? I didn't say slave. I didn't say slave. I said helper, okay? I said, <laughs> I said helper, all right?
I wonder how many breaks of heritage Jason is going to fill. I really would like to leave him none. Well, the room's dying down a little bit right now. But hopefully it picks back up by the time we uh, are almost done with this one. So we can fill number four. If I can at least do four, I'll be happy. Been straight relics. Rick Porcello, Red Sox. Relic. So far we have the one auto for the Astros Altuve. But we still have six boxes left to go through. So still got half a case. Let's see what's in the rest of it. Put the stuff aside. Boom, boom, boom. Do I have water? I do not. I'm going to go grab some water right quick. Does everybody know H2O is that breaking fuel? Breaking fuel. It's nice to get up off the chair every now and then. Stretch the old gluteus maximus. Uh, the last smoke. Oh boy. I don't even know how far back, Ryan. Because you could be watching the live stream. You can, you know what I mean? I don't, know. I don't know how far back to go here. Just know that we will double check this stuff, uh, Ryan. So no worries. Did I see a smoke there? Maybe in this pile? The uh, the veteran base pile? Nope, I don't see it here either. Nope. I put it to the left, which means it would have to be in this stack up here. Well, dude, Ryan, I mean, <laughs> God, I have no idea, bruh. Just know we will go through every single card. You know, that's why I'm separating all this stuff in the first place. But we will go through all this stuff multiple times, man. So if I did miss anything, trust me, we will catch it and make sure to send it out to you. And that's why we also show everything on the screen. In case we do mess up and miss something, there's evidence. There is proof. So, dude, I, I, I don't know, man. We'll take care of it if, if there is one, Ryan. No worries. <laughs> don't worry. Be happy. <laughs> Don't worry, be happy. Do, 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 do. Don't worry. Do, 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 do. Be happy. Do, 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 do. Yep, number 14. Or, oh, God. Heritage number four. At 14 spots left.
And we got 14 people watching from what I can tell. That's not how you open a pack. Drink some water. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm pretty good at catching the variations. something up there. Technology is only good as long as it works. Piece of crap. So what does everybody have planned for the weekend? Anything fun, exciting? Maybe going out of town, out of the country maybe? Some good, like a one on one autograph or something that would be sweet for somebody. We got a black Joey Gallo for the Rangers. Excuse me. Black Francisco Trevelli for the Pirates. That just means we're going to end with a blaze of glory. You know, Eric? Yeah, it's it's she, she is a creepy little creature. Uh, when did you, like, how did you hear about it? Back in the beginnings of the internet, 
we had this thing called uh, Screamers, where you would think you're watching one video, next thing you know, it's a fucking picture of the, uh, the exorcist chick screaming in your face. Can't tell you how many monitors I have punched because of that. A few. It, it was almost, it, it was so bad for me that I, I would just stop watching videos on the internet, period. Just, uh, just out of fear that I, it would be a screamer. <coughs> what what what's it about anyway, Eric? I saw something on my uh, on my YouTube feed. Same thing. It was like a, a newscast or something, warning uh, warning parents to make sure their kids aren't watching it or something like that. Ah, the good old Rick Roll. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Wait, how does it go? Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna do, do, do something and hope. Well, I don't know, man. I, that's been so long. Good song too. We're no strangers to love. Dun, 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 dun. And so do I. Really? Really? Huh. Interesting. I'll admit, it's definitely creepy looking. Very, very creepy looking. I just want to know, like, what video... Like, does she just pop up, like, on random videos? Like, right now, like, Momo just comes up here like, Hey, kids! That's some creepy shit. Dude, I've seen, like, my... Ne my they're not my nephews or nieces. They're my cousins. They're little cousins. But I've seen, like, my little kids. Like, my... Like... They have, like, it's so annoying, but they have, like, iPhones and stuff. So, like, they're always on their phone watching videos on YouTube. And I saw this one video, like, one of my cousins was watching. It was, like, a Spider-Man. Like, there was a, a guy dressed up as Spider-Man. And there was, like, someone else dressed up as, like, a Frozen character. But they were, like, wrestling. But it was, like, it was, like... It was kind of erotic. I don't know. It was, it was a little. It was it was one of the weirdest things I've seen actually. I... Why can't kids just go to Rotten.com like I used to? Or go to Newgrounds.com and play play Flash games. Or E-Bombs World. Is E-Bombs World still a thing? That's where a good portion of my nightmares came from. Oh, I'm going to E-Bombs World and check out a video. Oh, it's a screamer. Oh, God. Dark, dark times in the internet. Dark times. All the Albies for the Braves. The action image. We're bound to get an autograph here. I feel it. I feels it. We still got uh, four boxes to go after this. 
and then we're done with this case. <clears throat> now I want to now I want to listen to the Rick Roll song. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna let you down. So I don't know, man. I can tell exactly how you're feeling. Or something like that. We need to bring that back, the Rick Roll. Rick Ashley, that's his name? I thought it was Rick Astley or something like that. There's an autograph for the Yankees. There you go, Brad. A little something for you. Rookie auto for Justice Sheffield. On card auto, of course. Very nice. There you go. The one filler spot we had there. There you go, Brad. A little something for you. I don't think you're watching, but you know you, you probably are now. You know tomorrow or, or whatever. You're welcome, anyways. Now I want to. Now I need to listen to the uh, to the Rick Roll. Austin mod question mark question mark not sure what you mean by that could you be more specific player from the Himalayas Now that one is uh, the black variation, but there's multiple teams on that. So I will have to random it. My meter's going off again. Oh no. Stay tuned, Derek. Stay tuned. Don't pull the trigger just yet. Austin, that is, that's awesome. I'm, I'm glad that I'm happy to hear that, man. I am happy to hear that. Can't just go around asking for mods, though, man. That's what's wrong with your generation. You want everything handed to you. I'm just messing with you. Hope you're having a great day, kid. Good job, Eric. Good job, good job, good job. Sometimes you just just let it roll. Just let it roll. See where it goes. See where it goes. <clears throat> Quick check. Where are we with the uh, number four here? Ah, stuck at 14. Got this box and three more to go. Twelve people watching. That's going to be a tough fill, but I think we can get it done. Oh. 
Hi kids, do you like violence? Want to see me stick nine inch nails through each one of my eyelids? Who said that? I think he said nine inch nails. I don't know. Anyway. <clears throat> what, Eric? Maybe he did say that. I don't know. But I'm, I'm, I'm talking about a rapper. Probably the goat, to be honest. Ah, okay. Well, it's a rapper, Eric. Oakland fan in the house? What's up, play a pimp? Over on Breakers? How you doing, dude? Ah, another mini. He he is alive. He is alive, Eric. He is alive. Friend Mil Reyes to 100, the mini there. Not much Oakland fan ripping some uh, heritage right now. Living the dream. How's everything with you, playa? From the Himalayas. There's an autograph for a Blue Jay, too. The last team bought. There you go. Danny Jansen. Blue Jays autograph. That is correct, Eric. That is correct. Eminem. What's the name of that's hi my name is, man. It's the very first it's like the first bar. Hi, my name is what? My name is who? Chicka Chicka Slim Shady. Juan Soto Nationals to 570. There you go, Ryan. Last spot mojo coming through for you. How's everything, Oakland fan? Long time no see. 
Hope all is well with you. Just been breaking, man. Grinding. Trying to get this thing going along here. You know what I'm saying? Oh, damn. I'm sorry to hear that, Oakland fan. Did she at least leave you like the dog or something? All jokes aside, that, that shit is tough, man. Keep your head up, baby. Uncle Jesse will keep you company until, you know, you find yourself another one and then you leave me. Because you find yourself another whore. It's all right, though. It's all right. You know, it's okay. You're just going to come crawling back to Uncle Jesse. It's all good. Shared custody of the pup. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's funny. See, that's the first step to recovery. You got a good sense of humor, man. You'll be all right. You'll be all right. Dude, Eric, I would, but my man, you know, my, my man's going through some shit right now. So the last thing I want to do is push a break down his throat when, uh, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, there's, yeah, just, yeah. Bro, bitches ain't shit but hoes and tricks, Oakland fan. God damn it. How dare she take the dog? How dare she? They, you know, they they hit you where they hit you where it hurts the most, man. Luckily, Uncle Jesse's here to. Uh, Hopefully, take away some of that pain. Bruh, I, I know you did not let her take the dog, bruh. I know you did it. Yeah, I was about to say, come on, dog. Did she take your balls, too? Yeah, she's carrying them around in her clutch right now. Good to hear, Oakland fan. Sick the Border Collie mix on her next time she's around. What's the name of the pupper? Uh -oh. His name is Raider. Nice. Come here, Raider. Sick him. Sick him. Get that bitch, Raider. Get that bitch. <laughs> good times. Good times. Well, listen. That BS aside, man, I'm, I'm glad that I can at least make you LOL on the internet. That BS aside, I'm glad to hear you're doing well. Don't even trip, dog. There's there's uh, more fish in the ocean or whatever the hell the saying goes. As we uh, continue this journey that is 
Heritage Baseball. Random as hell, but I could go for some pancakes. It'd be like that, Oakland fan. It'd be like that. You'll be all right, though, man. You'll be all right. Keep your head up, baby. Keep on keeping on. That's a big short print. Standing a little, you know, a little, I don't know. Aaron Nola, Phillies to 999. Matt Chapman, A's patch. Two boxes left. So far we have one, two, three autographs. I think we can get at least one more in one of the last two boxes. There you go. Good thing you you know you kept that hidden from her, Oakland fan. Because if she knew what kind of uh, fire you had, you know, she she probably would have took that too. Have you added any new pieces to the collection? Good, good thing, Oakland fan. But you never know, man. You never know. Seems like it ended on good terms. At least I hope so, anyway. Breakups suck. Dude, I'm I'm doing well. I can't complain. You know, I've been I've been grinding at this breaking business here since the last time you seen me. Uh, definitely gotten a lot better at filling breaks. So you know, that that's definitely a good thing. You know, ever since we started doing eBay breaks, man, we we've definitely grown a lot, and uh, we will continue to grow moving forward. So that's pretty exciting. But yeah, man, we you know we we've definitely increased the uh, the Rip City family. Uh, I go I go I'm still live five days out of the week. Jason is live Fridays and Saturdays, so he'll be here tomorrow or today or whatever. He'll be live Fridays and Saturdays. I'm on every other day, so Sunday through Thursday I'm live. Starting at 5 o'clock Eastern Time. 
And yeah, man, just honestly, just been grinding, dude. I, I haven't had time uh, to really, you know, do anything else. You know, on my days off, I'm usually catching up on sleep or, you know, you know, doing something for the store. Yeah, but but I do try to disconnect and I, and I try to go out and have fun and you know be around other people. I'm turning thirty this year. Hopefully, if I make it, my birthday's November twentieth, and uh, I already asked Jason, and he gave me the okay. Uh, I'm going to be going on a cruise. Yeah, buddy. Going to be going on a cruise. So looking forward to that. Y you know what, the Oakland fan? Saying it out loud, though, it sounds ridiculous. Because in my mind, I'm still like a 15-year-old. You know what I mean? But apparently, I'm about to be 30. Like, I, 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 and every, like, I feel it. Like, I'm starting to feel it. Like, my back will hurt out of nowhere. I'll stretch and something, like, pops out of place somehow. So, and, and, and like, when I, like, like, I took, like, a chick on a date, like, the, like, a while ago, and she was, like, she was, like, 22, 23, at the time I was 29, I'm still 29, and, like, I don't even want to be, like, around loud noises, I ain't trying to be at no club every weekend, like, it's, I'm getting old, I'm getting old, and, you know, the way she was talking to me, she was talking like a completely different language. So anyway, yeah. I just been focused on trying to get this uh, breaking thing going, man. Get rid of some debts and uh, really get this breaking thing popping. But I, you know, I, I'll admit there there are times where, you know, if I if I don't break anything, you know, I don't get paid. So, it, you know, for a while, it, it, it sometimes it, get, it does get stressful. You know, I sit and think like, man, you know, yeah, this is an awesome opportunity, and and this, that, and the other. But you know, there's also negatives like with anything in life. But you know. I definitely don't want to quit doing this. It's it's a pretty sweet gig. I've grown to love it. E even though I don't collect cards personally, it's a sweet gig. A Brave White Sox 999. Until, like I said, if you don't break anything, you don't get paid anything. So, it, it definitely a, a kick in the ass. Make sure you're always on your P's and Q's and and always uh trying to find you know ways to sell stuff Perez of the Royales with a little relic mojo there for you I hear you well yeah you know exactly like you collect and stuff like that so for you you know I, I can only imagine but for me you know, I don't collect I don't you know I don't participate in the hobby I watch sports and that's pretty much it uh, but, you know, since I've started breaking up until this point, I've definitely learned a lot about the hobby. Enough to know that this is an action image. Aaron Judge of the Yankees. Right there. Yeah, dude, I don't collect, I don't sell, none of that. So, I'm still learning. Definitely one of those things that you never stop learning. It's fun. I, I like it, man. I like it. Definitely beats uh, waking up at 8 in the morning to go to a 9 to 5. It can be stressful at times, but hey, you know, what job isn't?
you know, the way I see it, I'm going to give, you know, been giving this a shot. And if, you know, for whatever reason things don't work out, I can always find a job at McDonald's or something. I ain't even worried about that. I can always start over from square one. So, you know, while I have this opportunity, I'm definitely giving it my all. And see where we go from there. I'm, cons I'm, I'm, I'm gonna start making YouTube videos too. Like skits and stuff like that. So hopefully that could be something too. I, I, one thing I've learned about myself since I've started being a breaker is, you know, people seem to think that I'm funny. You know, apparently I have a likable personality. So, you know, who knows? Maybe it could turn into something as far as entertainment with YouTube and whatnot. I'm actually going to work on a skit uh, this weekend, tomorrow and, uh, and Saturday, and hopefully record it so I can start editing and all that good stuff and put it up so I can go viral. Do I remember GPK? I do not. I do not. This is the last box mojo, baby. Last box, and we're done with this case number three. Still got 14 teams left in heritage number four. What is that? GP, what is GPK? Oh, garbage pail kids. Okay. Like the trading cards or like the actual like figurine or whatever, like the toys. There's some money in that stuff, man. That's another thing I've learned in this hobby is that people will pay for anything. Dude, I've... The other day, a fucking rookie Brady sold for like half a million dollars. A contender's rookie, PSA 9, Tom Brady, sold for, for about $400,000. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Wow, Oakland fan. Wow. Well, at the time, who, who, like, how were you to know? You know what I mean? I bet you're kicking. If you had held on to that thing, man. You'd be rolling in the dough right now. That's another thing with this hobby is like you get you just you never know which of these players is gonna turn into like the greatest thing of, of life. Like you know that Tom Brady, you sold it for a hundred bucks, and that same dude probably sold it for half a million. <laughs> Last box mojo. Let's see what we got here. Good luck, everybody. Especially those without a hit. I'm predicting one last autograph coming out of this case. Or I should say out of this box here. I feel it. I feel it. I feel a powerful presence.
Salvador Perez for the Royals to nine ninety nine. At the time, you were probably like, "Hell yeah!" But now you're no, not not so much. I mean, how are you to know? You know. I'm sure those hundred bucks got you out of a jam back then. Good old PBS. Come on, baby. That's an action image for Urias Padres. Some couple stacks here. Be sure print there. Ah, there's a relic. To finish things off, Ben Zobrist, the Cubs patch. Unless they sneak an autograph here in this last pack. Or maybe one of those box toppers. I have yet to see a box topper legit auto. Maybe that'll change uh, here shortly. Let's see what else we got. Was gonna do it for the break. Yeah, let's open up the box toppers here. Before I do that, though, I just want to show something here. We have cards with multiple teams on them. All right, such as these, as you can see. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have my sorters give one to every team. Since we have multiples, all right. So at least uh, every team is going to get one of each of these cards. So for example, you know, one Cardinal, one Royal, one A, one Red Sox, one one Ranger. You know, depending on the card and the teams on it, every team will get one card, all right? To save some time here. Dude, a hundred bucks was a lot of money back in two thousand one. Not for nothing. Shit, you can get yourself like two Air Force. You can get like two pairs of shoes for a hundred bucks back in the day, and good ones like Nikes. Like not no cheap shit. All right, let's see what we got in here. Like I went into the store to buy some Air Force run, uh, Air Force Ones, thinking they were like sixty something bucks. Oh no. To my surprise, damn near a hundred dollars. Joe Rudy of the A's, the nineteen seventies card. I'm down, Eric, I'm down. Willie oh, I'm sorry, Billy Wilson, Phillies. We got Pat Dobson, Padres.
Bill Russell, Dodgers. What else? What else? What else? Robert Wine for the Expos. The Expos, if I'm not mistaken, are the Nationals. And Eddie Leon. The Indians 1970 card. Why does that sound familiar? Anyways. What else we got here? Ah, the good old box toppers. Johnny Bench of the Reds. Again, that's not an actual autograph. I wish it would be. Because that would have been sick. We have Otani with the box stopper. Very nice looking on the card. Sorry for bringing that up, Oakland fans. Mookie Betts. Wow, really? Put that away. Wow, I'm starting to lose it. All right, what's in this? Excuse me. Brooks Robinson, Orioles. And last but not least. Ronald Acuna Jr. for the Braves. That's what I'm talking about, Oakland fan. I just gotta, you just gotta find the next Tom Brady. That's all. That's all. All right. We also got this poster for Adrian Beltre. Pretty sweet. It is numbered 21 of 30. All right. So there you go. A little something for the Rangers. <sighs> now the one thing I do need to random is these cards here. As you can see, they don't have any team affiliation, so I do need to random them. All right. Roll the die here. See how many times we're going to do the randomizer. Josh, don't tell me how to live my life. I don't do ones, twos, or threes because I'm just weird that way. So we will go 12 times. How's everything with you? Uh, dude, Oakland fan, I don't have breakers open. So let me finish this, and I, I'll, I'll, I'll check with you. All right, so let's take that down. Come into the random. So this one's going to have all teams involved for the flashback cards. Copy this. Paste it there. I'm going to go 12 times. The top team gets the flashback cards. What are you, what are you doing awake anyway, Josh? And the money shot, 12. Boom, 12 times. Cardinals at the very top. Whoa, that's my line. I, I, dude, I've been saying that since forever. Don't tell me how to live my life. I've been saying that. Copycat. Anyways, it's been going. Been feeling straight up. Heritage breaks tonight. And the flashbacks are going to the Cardinals, okay? There's that. Just got home from the bar. Must be nice. All right, so for this one, I'm going to put numbers down because it's a quick uh, random here for this card. Usually, I just give one to each, but since it's the black variation, we I, I do need to make a decision here. 
So I assign numbers. The top three will be one, two, three. Bottom two, four, five. So one, two, three, four, five. All right. That is why I have numbers one through five on the screen. I put them twice too to make it more of a uh, legit random. At least that's how it works in my mind. So we're going 12 times. Top number wins that card. The uh, NL pitching leaders black variation. Mm, muddy shot. Boom. 12 times the number three. So the top right team will win this uh, card here. Top right team being the Nationals. So there we go. National boom. Josh didn't drink at the designate uh designate drive. The ladies, what a gentleman I know. No, what a sucker, that's what. Uh now I'm gonna kill this bong and hit the sheets. Nice. Nice, nice. I like that. Not, not a bad way to end the night. Not a bad way to end the night. Uh, what the hell was I going to do? Oh, yeah. Recap. That's what. So. You bigger man than me. I would have told them girls. Uh, have you heard of Uber? Download the app. You save like $20 on your first ride. Anyways. So hits are considered autographs. Patches and one of ones. Because uh, we do have a hitless giveaway to do here. Not a hit, but nice to see. Friend Mio Reyes. Number to 100. The mini for the Padres there. It's kind of cool. Uh, got some uh, variations here. Urias Padres action. Aaron Judge Yankees action. Albies Braves. Arenado Rockies. Altuve Astros. Bregman Astros. And Mike Trout of the Angels. With the uh, action variations there. Now, this is a hit here. Mike Trout Angels patch. Alright, let me make this easier for myself. Alright, boom. So, Angels there. Green. Syndergaard Mets. Green. Rizzo Cubs. Two hitless spots are going to get a dice roll. Yanni Molina Cardinals. And four spots will uh, get into the $2,500 giveaway taking place Sunday. Porcello Red Sox. Braun Brewers. Chapman A's. For you. <laughs> there you go, Josh. <laughs> what kind of tacos? The the Doritos Locos tacos? I'm not a big fan of those, honestly. Perez Royals. Like, it was cute when they first came out. Now, they're just like... Uh, I don't know. One thing about Taco Bell is, like, I dude, I can spend $20 at Taco Bell and then be hungry afterward. Zobra's Cubs patch. Dude, I've hit some pretty nice stuff. Uh, here, check out these autos. Daniel Jansen Blue Jays. Justice Sheffield Yankees. Brandon, it did break. I just haven't uploaded the video yet, man. I've been busy all day. Yankees with a hit there. And Altuve for the Astros with the autograph. I would say the biggest hit I've hit today, Josh would probably be Nolan Ryan. I hit a Nolan Ryan autograph in the first break of Heritage actually. Uh, so Brandon, in case you didn't if you didn't hear me the first time, I haven't uploaded any of the videos yet, but Heritage 1, 2 and 3 for the store already filled. Now, congrats to the people on the screen there in green. That means you got a hit. You either got an autograph or you got a one-on-one or a patch. Everyone else, unfortunately, did not. But don't fret. Uncle Jesse going to try to hook you up a little something-something. Two hitless spots will win 
a dice roll each, which equals guaranteed hits. All right. For more info on the dice rolls, check out our website, ripcitycards.com. We're going to go 12 times here in this randomizer. The top two names win the uh, dice roll here. Let's see who we got. And the money shot, 12. Boom, 12 times. Francisco gets his pick of the dice roll and then Andy gets to pick between the two left very nice so that is that put that right there let me get rid of that now for the other promo every heritage break we fill four random people whether you get a hit or not will be chosen to advance into our $2,500 giveaway taking place this Sunday March the 3rd so four random people will advance to get a shot to win up to $2,500 in break credit. All right, going to go 12 times here. The top four names advance. Good luck. And the money shot 12. Boom. 12 times. Top four names are Jordan, Ryan, Carlos, and Matt. Congratulations to the four of you. You got a chance at winning up to $2,500 in break credit. So you're telling me there's a chance? That's exactly what I'm saying. Congrats. We'll get it up.